Yeah. Happening today for the second time this week, dozens of dogs will board a plane in search for a new life. 23 ABC's Leslie Marine joining us live in the Northwest this morning, where volunteers are already prepping these puppies before they're <laughs> off to the airport this morning. Good morning, Leslie. Good morning, you guys. You can already hear these dogs barking because they're ready to go off to New York. There's going to be about 25 dogs from the Kern County Animal Services going off on this trip and about 100 dogs in total leaving from Kern County to New York. Right now, we have Maggie Kalar here with the Kern County Animal Services. Maggie, we know what happens to these dogs here. Where, where are they going? We want to know what happens on the other end. Well, they're going to three different rescue organizations in New York, and that would be the North Shore Animal League, Social Tees Animal Rescue, and the Sean Casey Animal Rescue. And once they get there, they may already have adoptive families waiting at the airport to come and take them right there. And some of them that don't have homes just yet may be going into foster homes until they can match up the right families. But they are definitely in demand in New York, and we're so pleased to be able to partner with West Wings of Rescue to do this flight today. And Wings of Rescue, uh, you guys did one trip earlier this week on Tuesday, I believe, and you guys are just being able to do more and more, but it's all through the help of the community. Absolutely. Wings of Rescue is a nonprofit organization that is funded solely through donations. Volunteer pilots sign up, they use their planes, they get the fuel, and we want to be able to pay that fuel to be able to fly these animals to wherever we can to find new homes. So there's a couple of ways that people can help um, through donations. Number one, they can donate directly to wingsofrescue.org to fund the, to continue to fund these fl life saving flights. Number two, they can drop off airplane approved carriers. As you can see with the dogs, we're constantly needing those as we're trying to do maybe one, two flights a month. And so they're going back to where these organizations are, and then we have to get new ones to come back. And then, third, you know, they can sign up to be a short term foster parent, you know, to take these dogs out of the shelter for a couple of weeks, give them a chance to kind of relax and get prepared for the flight. So, those are several ways that people can donate to continue to save these animals. Well, definitely. These dogs will start being uh, heading off to Meadows Field in a couple minutes here, then it's off. Off to New York at 8 a.m. The public's actually invited to come out, give these dogs a goodbye. It'll be at the uh, Jet Center there at Meadows Field. So it looks to be a good trip for these guys.